Hey y'all, it's Elena. Welcome to my channel. And today I'm gonna be reacting to the new trailer called Blame. I'm pretty sure it's an independent film. I haven't heard much about it. It was released at the beginning of November and based on the thumbnail, like maybe the protagonist is like a younger teenage, like high school girl. Let's just watch a strange romance Abigail, movie. Your parents and I feel that it might be better if you started school with your own class. This way you can start off the year just like everyone else. Oh my God, she's back. Hey, what was that name everybody kept calling her last year? <laughs> Welcome back, Sybil. <laughs> My name is Jeremy Woods. You guys ever read The Crucible? Arthur Miller? Abigail Williams. This is the villain of the play. It's a great, great, great part. It's a difficult part. Anyone want to try to tackle that? I'm going to have to go with the namesake, Abigail. Found that paper. Abigail. Thanks for, for doing this. There's not really anyone else that I'm close to. I don't have anyone that I'm really close to either. I'll do the scene with you. What if I told you you wanted someone quiet? I just keep running fast. Away from my coming back You can pick me up tonight Oh, child You got that lion in you Let me lay you down you What are you doing? Get out! What, what is this? He said, oh, child, Why didn't you pick me for that part? Why did you pick her? Let me lay you, down. you know she was in a psych ward for like six months, right? He doesn't know, does he? he said, oh, Shut up. You know what? Don't tell me how to talk to you. At least she's not obsessed with some pedophile. Do you really not see that she's just jealous? I feel very conflicted about this. Like, um, like, mm. It just seems like catty girls going after the same teacher who is also a pedophile. I don't know if I can get down with this. I feel kind of like, oh. I don't know if we could call this a strange romance. It's just strange. I feel kind of gross now. <laughs> in no way in this trailer is it addressed that the teacher should not be with this young girl. Like, no, that's not a thing that should be happening. No. So, I don't really know. I'm disturbed. I feel like this was problematic and quite frankly, probably wouldn't watch it. I mean, like, I was initially intrigued because they were like, ooh, The Crucible, and I'm like, ah, I love The Crucible. <laughs> Just like, kind of deteriorated, and um, we have this creepy romance, 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 it's not a romance, with the professor teacher person, and it's gross because he's probably in his 30s and she's clearly like underage. Yeah, don't take advantage of your students' teachers out there. <laughs> I guess I knew the actors in this. Well, actually, I recognize the teacher, the actor that plays the teacher, but the two girls, I didn't recognize the actresses that play them. The one who's clearly dressed like more scandalously um, at the beginning of the trailer, who had like pink streaks in her hair or whatever, of purposely ignoring this one girl, clearly ignoring her to choose the more like conservative looking girl. So I'm like, okay, well, first, <laughs> let's not be prejudiced and discriminate. Second, like, really? This is gross. Oh, I just feel gross. Um, yeah, let me know how you felt about this trailer in the comments below. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Bye, guys. See you soon. The way makes everything better, though, so it's all good. <laughs> Christmas. Oh.